Alright guys, continue on here with the uh, franchise. Uh, we'll go down here to the athletics. Boy, my team wins a few games here. Up, of course. <laughs> oh, he's back. Awesome. Alrighty. Where's my team's record? 28 and 40. My goodness. Well, athletics are not any better. No, let's go. Man, look at this. I just went from here. We got win, win, loss. My goodness, we lost a bunch. Alright, well, let's go. Wow, well, there's an off day after this. Man, I forgot to do my lineups again. Darn it. Jesus Carmona. What is he, a center fielder? I'll put him as DH. Whoa, what did I just do? Quite sure what I just did there. There we go. Alright, let's do it. Yeah, my team's awful on the road. Wow, their team's awful on the road, too. Pretty bad at home as well. Alright, here we go. Let's turn this up. In Northern California, MLB there you go. Has baseball from the Oakland Coliseum. Today, ah, lower, low viewership for this game. <laughs> Mike Fultonevich gets All right, here we go. For the A's in this one. Harold, any thoughts? Well, his last three outings have been interesting. He hasn't been bad, hasn't been great, but he's walked away with a no decision. So today he's looking to go maybe a little bit deeper and see if he can walk away with that W. Harold, these A's as they begin play here this afternoon, they come in off a loss. Yes. Time out, but they've been playing well, winners of five straight prior to that game. Yeah, Matt. I mean, they won the first two games. They played really good ball, and then lost yesterday's game. They still got a chance now to win the series. You don't want to split it after you win the first two. It's a pivotal game for them. Throw over to the back. Jerk off. Dive, but he's back. Runners going. I should have kept going. I thought he was going to pitch out. Frickin' heck. Ready with the nothing in one pitch. Oh! A swing and a miss at a ball down. He broke out the slide step there, Danny. Yeah, he's clearly thinking about the steal right here. Didn't happen, but the cat-mouse game continues on. And this is in the air down the left field line and into foul territory. Rashman will get there as he makes the catch in foul territory for the first out. Here's the switch hitting Victor Martinez. He's got hits in each of the last five ball games. And he'll miss the target away with a fastball. It's 1-0. Oh. The 1-0 -oh pitch. Runners off for second. Are you kidding me? Really? But they got him. Great pick and tag to catch him trying to steal. From the windup, the one-one pitch. And a knuckle curve missed that time. Two and one. Backdoor breaking ball just missed right there. It's such an effective pitch if you can hit the corner with it, but no dice this time. Ooh. Well, as demonstrated there, that's a tough pitch to do anything with. Oh, you think? If you've got a good fastball like he does, that location can be really effective. It looks so tempting to the hitter, but making contact on that pitch can be very tough. Here comes the payoff pitch. And here's a ball hit in the air. Rasmus 
on the move. And it, in fact, lands in the corner. Foul. Pulled toward right center field. Marizzi ah. is under it. And the inning is over. One hit in the inning, but that gets... Now with the plate, Jose Ramirez. It lead things off here in the bottom half of the first. For the Third baseman, Jose Ramirez. And a fastball in the dirt that's taken for a ball. Well, this Yankee ball club entering play this afternoon here, Harold. They come in looking to make it two in a row as they were winners last time out. Yeah, Matt, the series didn't start the way they wanted to. Clearly, you lose the first two games, then you win yesterday. That's why a win today gives you a split. You salvage the series. Oh, he lifts a high nice. pop up. Drifting into foul territory on the right side. Oh, and he can't really. Oh, my goodness. Well, really? Times in day games. It's easy to say that from here that he should have made the play, but the ball gets lost in that big sky sometimes. It's a play that should have been made. You kind of feel bad for him at the same time. Sent fouled again. And that after being kind of makes him mad. Even at two and two. Into the windup. Here comes the 2 2 pitch. Oh, my God. I hate this windup. No pitcher likes to take the count to three and two, especially when you throw a non-competitive pitch like that on two and two. That one wasn't even. Ah. That gets through, and he'll start the inning off with a base hit. So here in the first inning, the leadoff man's aboard to kick things off. Digging in, Marcus Semien. He's hitting in the 270s on the season coming into this one. Curveball looked at here for strike one. Now a fastball off the plate away, a ball and a strike. The 1-1 one -one pitch. This one's chopped foul right at the plate. The count moves now to one and two. Boy, he fouled that breaking ball off a little bit early. Timing not quite there. It had a fastball to pitch before. He just got out in front of that breaking ball. Hoping to send him packing. Pitch on its way. Swinging a soft liner to Gordon for one. On to ah. first, but not in time as he's in there ahead of the throw. Edwin Encarnacion now. He begins playing this one with his batting average over the 310 plateau. Sends that one out of play for strike one. Set to deliver the 0 and 1. Another one fouled off, and he's quickly behind 0 and 2. Another one sent foul. Runner at first here, one man out. And no! What the freak? Right. That gets down, and he's got himself a base hit. And they'll have runners at the corners following the one. <sighs> well, this ball's hit off the wall. He hit it awfully hard. Now, I thought it was a good move to stop because a lot of times you go, oh, he's dogging it. Looked like he was going pretty good, but I think they're going to throw him out. Good read to get back to first. And a high strike there, 0 and 1. Well, this is what they didn't do yesterday. Execute with runners in scoring position. So now you got a chance. Here it is already in this ball game. You got a guy sitting there in scoring position. Drive him in, execute, and you jump away from yesterday's loss. Lazy fly ball out to center field. Davis moving in. And that's the second out of the inning. And even with two away now, that ball just didn't get out there deep enough, so they'll hold him at third base. So striding in, Buster Posey. And he really thrives in the batter's box here at home. Something to keep an eye on in this one. And this is taken outside for ball one. In prior meetings with Marco Estrada, he's gone two for six. Oh, come on. Change up low, 2-0. 2-0 oh. oh count, runners at the corners. You can bet he's looking for something to drive right here. There's really? He gets something to hit, too. Outside. Well, I'm not going to worry about this too much. To deliver on 3-0. Hit back up the middle. Played on the backhand. Nice. And the A's fail to cash in here as this... So stepping in, Gene Segura. It's been a rough go for him at the plate as he enters this one with a season average in the 230s. Yes. And that one's in on the hands to start the inning. It's ball one. Pitch on the way. Here's a ah. and a miss, one and one.
This is hit high in the air out toward left center. On the move is Rasmus. And he Dang it. it down. Nice play for the first down. Coming to the plate now, Stephen Vogt. He's not among the league leaders in home runs, but his total does top this ball club. And here's a fastball called for strike one. Into the windup, here comes the 0 1. Swung out. Ah! Man, how lightly you have to tap it to be a check swing. My God. Hope to settle in quickly and get into a groove, and he's definitely done that so far in the early going. Looks like he could go pretty deep into this one. That's the kind of pitch that reminds me of many. Re Ouch, that one hit. Ah. When we take a look at this one on slow motion, you can see he does a little bit of that cha 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 as this thing comes right down on top of his foot. Maybe even the big toe. Might seem funny, but those ones can hurt and cause injuries. And he yes. is safe at second base as the decision to move up pays off, and that'll likely be scored a wild pitch. The 1 0 delivery. Hard hit at third. Nice. And just past his outstretched glove into left, the base hit. And the runner from second will stay put at third, so they're runners at the corners now with one away. Great recognition. He's looking for a ball Roger, up. The breaking ball hung, and he stayed with it. When they're up high, let it fly. When they start out low, you got to let it go. In now, Rajay Davis. And there you see his righty-lefty splits and how they've played out so far this season. Swing and a liner. Foul. And this is in the air down the left field line and into foul territory. Rasmus is there. Let's see if they test it. And never much of a chance to even think about scoring there. What a big second out. Well, that sucks. Ben Revere. He was one for four with a two bagger in yesterday's game. He'll hold off on the slider to start the at bat. It's ball one. Looking to wiggle out of this, here it is. And he fires in a strike this time to make it one ball and one strike. One and one, here it is. And here's a ball hit in the air. Oh! Untouched. Dang it. At the corners, two men out. Uh, slightly fell, mother. Now a swing and a ball popped high in the air over toward foul ground. And this will land foul. Dang, I keep getting late. And no! Oh, come on! Here's Michael Saunders now. Currently with the third best home run total on the ball club. Michael Saunders! And a fastball's in there for strike one. Pretty good pitch to hit there that he let go. I know it's early and probably wanting to run his pitch count up, but he may not get another pitch like that to swing at the rest of the game. Into the windup. Here comes the 0-2 pitch. And another foul ball. Whoa, he tried to get a little cute right there. A little two-strike changeup. He thought he might get a swing and miss, but man. He left that in the zone. He's fortunate that ball didn't leave the park. Oh, that's a good sign right there. After the fastball, he gets that change up and he stayed right on it. Just couldn't keep it fair. He's seeing the ball well, though. He's just fouling him off till he gets something he wants to hit. That, too, will be a foul ball and will stay 0-2. And a change nice. swung on and missed for the first down. Into the box, Colby Rasmus. He comes in currently tied for third in home runs on the team. And that misses inside one and zero. Into his windup, here comes the one zero. And Jesus, he had up on two really close ones, really. Sets up really good right here, right? Hasn't seen the fastball yet, but now he gets to count it two balls, two strikes. 
He has to be looking for a fastball right here. He still might be looking for that release point on that curveball early in this outing. That one looked like it popped out of his hand behind his ear instead of out front. We'll see if he finds that pitch because it'll be important for him. Pretty lucky to get away with that one. Nice. There's not a situation ever where you want to throw a high changeup, so I think he'll try to make an adjustment with the next one he throws. Here's Kelly Johnson. He enters play hitting down in the 240s for the year. Skied into straightaway right. Stanton has a read on it. Yeah, that works. Makes the catch, and that'll retire the side. One, two, three, go the eight. Welcome back to Oakland as we're set for the start of the third from the Coliseum here on MLB Network. Infield in the overshift here. Now the pitch. And he got him out in front that time. Strike one. The wind up and the 0 1. And there's one well above the zone for a ball. Ready with the 1 1 pitch. And what the heck? Good slider that time. Ready on one and two. Outside and low that time. Now it's two balls and two strikes. Into the windup. Here comes the 2 2 pitch. Swing and a what the heck? The same way he ended the second with a punch out one away. Here's D. Gordon now. A base hit in his first trip. D. Gordon. And a strike called at the knees. Nothing in one. Into the windup. Here comes the 0 and 1. Popped up. Semyon on the move. Has to barehand it. Nice grab, but no play at first, and that'll be scored a single. Infield single, as innocent as it may sound, that might be a rally starter right there. Eduardo Nunez. Striding in once again, Eduardo Nunez. 0 for 1 here in the early going. Watches a fastball right there for strike one. Hey, Matt, you might be wondering, why did he take that pitch right there? Well, a lot of times as the two-hitter, and you got a guy that can run on first base, you have your own signs between each other, and you're saying, basically, I'm going to give you one pitch to run on. After that, it's my at-bat. Two takes, and now he's down 0-2. I'm not sure, but he may have been taking to give the guy first a chance. Come on! Gets him swinging, two gone. Digging in to try it again. Victor Martinez. 0 for 1 for him here in this one. Ready with the first pitch. Here it comes. And a pitch out. Nothing doing though. And that's ball one. Third inning. No score to this point. In there. And it's even at one. set here comes the 1-1 one, one. hit out towards second ah. on to Encarnacion at first and that ends the inning so no run here's Jake Marisnik hitless in Leading four tries in the ball game yesterday center fielder Jake Marisnik hit on the ground out to short throw just in time Ooh, that's close so one gone now as you get a look there at where the Yankees stand currently in the American League East. Swing and he pops him up over toward foul territory. But this will land untouched. Oh, that's one he's going to want back right there. A fastball right in your wheelhouse and you foul it off. And a fastball mm, just misses. It's one and one. A one and one count. Here's the pitch. Low and inside with the breaking ball as that causes him to back up a bit. And he can't catch the corner here, so he's behind three and one. Well, this has been a good job to work the count from 0 and 1 to 3 and 1, and now he's really in the driver's seat to see a heater that he can do something with. And he'll take it to the bag himself for the out. Now batting. Shortstop. So striding Marcus. forward now, Marcus Semyon reached by way of a fielder's choice his first time around. Here's oh my God! Outside, it's ball one. 
Now the pitch. And this one's too far inside, ball two. Well, that's good hitting. You know why? Because he's looking for one specific pitch. Those pitches are close. It looks like to us he's laying off them, but they're not what he wants, so he didn't swing. That's evidence of a pitcher and catcher being totally in sync out there. That tells me they both know that's a good pitch for him right now. To two and two now. Even at two balls and two strikes, here's the pitch. And this is going to be fouled into the diamond level seats. Set to deal on two and two. And this one's chopped foul right at home plate. Seventh pitch of the at bat coming up. And again, he's unable to keep it fair, but he's putting together quite a battle at the plate. Well, that's three foul balls in a row. He's definitely battling up there. On the eighth pitch, there. that bat is the one that finally does it as he wears him down in the inning. A's are gone in order. We'll head to the fourth, still scoreless. Getting on for the Yankees. Gene Georgia. Segura standing in. Gene He'll start Segura. things out here in a tie ball game. This is hit down the right field line, but it's going to get out of play for strike one. The wind up and the 0 1. Down the third baseline, but this will be a foul ball as he's behind 0 and 2 now. Well, he's out in front of that breaking ball right there. I'm not surprised. I was after that fastball. Nice job of pitching, kind of keeping him off balance. There and we he's go. He's going to have extra bases to start the fourth. Segura turns and goes to second, and he's going to get to second now with nobody out. There's no question he's been struggling at the dish lately, trying to do anything to get himself going. So he's got to feel pretty good after that double. Not to take anything away from him, but I think I could have probably hit that pitch. Yeah, that's one of those gift pitches, not the location he was shooting for. Well, he's really having good success in this game. And, you know, looking at it, you go, how's he doing it? Well, it's surely not the first pitch strike. I mean, he's a little over 60% first pitch strikes. That's good. Darn it. That's great. For the type of success he's having, he can't figure it out. The 0-2 delivery. Hard hit ball to short. And that's through into left, a base hit. And they'll put the brakes on at third. Runners at the corners with nobody out. Well, Matt, this Up inning just got the interesting. It's got a chance to be pretty that's big. You start the inning with a double, and now you get the single, Hard and you're sitting out. first and third. And here they come. Sorry about that guy, phone ringing. <laughs> in now, Jesus Carmona, as the first pitch to him is in there for a called strike one. One for one after a single this first time up. The 0 and 1 delivery. And here's a ball hit in the air. Dozier ranging into the outfield. He gets there as the runner breaks for home. But no, he'll put on the brakes and head back to third. Up next for the Yankees. Center Stepping Davis. in and ready for Rajay another shot, Rajay Davis. Davis. He's 0 for 1 thus far. He's set and the pitch. And now a curveball as he's got to lean out of the way. That one nearly got him. First and third, you know he's going to do everything he can on the mound to roll up a double play ball. On the other side, he's got to be looking for a mistake up in the zone. Oh, my God. Pick up a sack fly at the very least. Jesus. Here's Ben Revere. Two men on, two away here in the fourth. Here's the first pitch to him. And that's inside for a ball. What an oh. As a look, now the pitch. Now a swing and a fly ball. On the move is Rasmus, and no one will track it down. Pitching has the upper hand early as we're scoreless in inning number four. And a good as he lays off, and the count moves to two and one now on the Yankee left fielder. Yeah, I think he missed that one, Matt. But you know what? That's going to happen. Umpires are part of the game. The human are going to make mistakes. He missed it. Oh, well, get over it. No! No! Darn it! Edwin Encarnacion now. He'll look to get something going here in this scoreless ball game. First baseman, number 10. And this man is a bit high. One ball, no strikes. 
pitch on the way. Foul back. One and one, here it comes. Fouled off again, and now he's in a one and two hole. Now a swing and a ball popped high in the air over toward foul ground. And this is taken in for <laughs> out number one. Here's Brian Dozier now. Comes into this at bat 0 for 1 in the ball game. Right through it here, and he's behind 0 and 1. And I believe they'll say he broke the plane as yes he did. It's ruled a strike. Now here's the pitch. Swing and a miss on nice. the breaking pitch. Two away. Here's Buster Posey now. Two away in the inning, and Dan, it looks like this could be another one, two, three inning for him. Yeah, he has really found a groove on the mound, and it's been impressive. Ah. It'll be interesting to see how long he can keep this dominance up. Into his windup, here comes the 1 0. That missed. Close. It's ball two. 2 0 count, here it comes. Now a swing, and he just fouls this one away. Into the windup. Here's the two and one pitch. It's a swinging bunt up the line. Throw in time, and the side is retired. The danger is Giancarlo Stanton. Giancarlo Stanton now. For one for him here in this one. Ready to deliver. Here's the first pitch. What the heck? What's wrong with that swing? And a fastball just a bit high. Pitch on the way. Back up the Oh, there is Dozier. And the fifth inning will start. Darn it, I wish I would have hit the pitcher. Dang it. So batter number 22. Second Here's D. Gordon now. D. Two base hits, Gordon. both singles to this point. Into the windup and the pitch. And you look at a fastball that doesn't miss by a whole lot. It's 1 0. Oh. Into his windup. Here comes the 1 0. Oh. Hit hard towards the hole. Yes. Great effort on the dive, but it's through into left. Well, Matt, I don't know if he was trying to go that way if he's a little now bit late. Batting. 96 mile an hour is tough to catch up to, but I got to give him credit. He did put the barrel on it. First things first, here's a throw over, and he'll dive back in. Perhaps wisely, another look to first. And now they've got him picked the up. The frick. <laughs> Better wait on this one. Into the box, Eduardo Nunez. Yes, he'll take a look at ball one. Oh, for two for him to this point. One oh count, here it is. A pitch out, the throw. And he will scurry back to first as he'll think twice about trying to move up. Ready with the 2 0 -oh pitch. On the ground is short. This could be two. Backhanded. The Dozier for one on the first, and it won't be in time to end the inning as he just about did a somersault out there at second base. Victor Martinez. Here's the switch hitting Victor Martinez. He comes in 0 for 2 thus far. Pitch swung on and hit in the air. Ah. And he'll get there in plenty of time to put this one away, and that ends the inning. Here's Michael Saunders now. He'll lead things off as we begin the home fifth. First pitch coming. Here it is. There's a changeup over the outside corner. Matt, I don't know if you know this, but less than 60% of his first pitches have been for a strike. And he's still having a good game. I, I don't know what he's doing. Nice. He's been able to figure him out. And this will be put away easily for the out. Ready for another chance? Colby Rasmus. 
He's 0 for 1 thus far. And he misses Ooh. inside with that one. Ball one. The 1 and 0 delivery. Now a swing and a miss, and I don't think he was expecting a pitch inside. It's 1 and 1. That was a pretty good pitch on a pitch he doesn't throw very often, or I should say hasn't used in this game, that's for sure. That was a good pitch. I like what I'm seeing right now. In, in, and then goes away. If you pound him in early, it opens up the outside half of the plate, and that's what he's doing right now. Now another one, two. Good job to spoil that one away, and he stays alive. He's right on that breaking ball. That's pretty good timing right there, especially falling up after a fastball. To two balls and two strikes now. Seems like he's thrown everything at him, the kitchen sink, and he just fouled him off. So he tried to throw something right there and make him chase, and he didn't. So I don't know where he goes from here. Here's one that misses inside, and the counts run full now. Three and two. Pulled high in the air. Go, 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 go. Come on. Go, go, go. Oh my god. Whew. Here's Kelly Johnson. Comes into this at bat 0 for 1 in the ball game. Oh. will take a look at ball 1. 1 and 0. You know what, Matt? He's been getting most of the pitches. I know he's complaining a little bit on this one, but he's been getting most of the pitches today. He, he should be feeling pretty good about himself. He's clearly looking to hit off the fastball and adjust. That's a pretty good swing after seeing two fastballs now in a row. Lifted the other Come on, go, 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 go. Revere is under it, and the inning is over. One. Gene Segura standing in. Better put in someone in the bullpen. Six innings, always the inning. That screws me up. Fooled him a bit as this is hit high in the air. Oh. Center and shallow. Saunders has the best view of this one, so he'll take it for the first down. Stephen. Into the windup and the pitch. Nope. Knuckle curve breaks outside for ball one. Well, he's having a good amount of success here, Dan, even though he hasn't really gotten a ton of swings and misses. Yeah, it amazes me how every game you pitch can be so different, Matt. Sometimes it feels like guys can't touch you and you're just punching everyone out. But other times, you don't have your good stuff and you really rely on movement and location to get out. No! Case for him Darn it! It's really working. Mm. You know what? His spot has been the outside pitch right there. And now we're late in the game and he continues to pound the outside pitch. And it's really working out for him. Look out! That one almost got away from him. Two and two now. This is flared out towards second. Nice. A leaping try, but it's out of his reach and into the outfield. Two strike hitting. Man, you love it when guys are able to fight the ball off Up and get a hit. Right here, he fights it off Designated and flips hitter. it over the middle infielder's head. Carmona. Stepping in now, Jesus Carmona. As he takes a cold strike at the knees, it's 0 1. 1 for 2 in the ball game thus far. Ready with the nothing in one pitch. Here's a looping ah. ball out to right. Saunders over to his right. Two gone. Here's Rajay now Davis buddy. now. 0 the for 2 on the afternoon Rajay so far. Davis. First pitch on its way. First pitch fastball off the plate there, and it's ball one. This one in the air out to left. Rasmus has a ah, and that ends man. the inning. Here's Jake Marisnik. He'll have the opportunity to kick things off as we begin the home sixth. First pitch fastball off the plate there, and it's ball one. The windup and the 1 0 pitch. Swing and he pops it up. Ah, Victor's not going to make this. And nope, this one falls, so he'll get another shot. Hey, 
And he looks at one in there, one and two. I love how aggressive he is. He's just attacking the zone with the fastball. Here it is. Now he's at one, two count. And really, he can nice. go anywhere he wants now. Curveball got him swinging for the first down. Ready for another chance. Jose Ramirez. He singled in two trips to the plate thus far. Now a ball go, 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 go. And there's the second Glad I got them fast outfielders. Now batting. Ready once again. Marcus Semyon. 0 for 2 here to start the afternoon. Here's a fastball chop foul at the plate at strike one. Here comes the 0 1. Here's yes. A swing and a high pop up. Vote. Waits on it, and that ends the inning. Digging in once again, Ben Revere. He'll start the seventh, and Dan, as a former pitcher yourself, you must be enjoying this. Lots of good pitching and defense today. Oh, that's one of the keys. We're seeing a lot of strikes. We're seeing a lot of swings. We're seeing some great plays on defense. This has been a snappy one up to this point. Line towards center field. Yeah, there we go. And some outfield grass. It's a base hit. So that's how they'll start out their half of the seventh inning. Another single. You talk about Up putting hits together game. and having nothing to show right, for. We've got a bunch of hits and are yet to score. Julian Castaneda takes the ball here as he'll enter with a runner at first and nobody out. Giancarlo Stanton is at the plate as he looks at ball one. Right there is a temptation pitch. Power hitters like this are looking for pitches that they can drive. So that may have been one where he was trying to get him to chase up above the zone a little bit. The 1 0 delivery. There goes the runner. Pitch swung on and missed the throw. And he will scurry back to first as he'll think twice about trying to move up. Oh, come on. Is there for it? One out. Riding in once again, D. Gordon. He's working on a three hit ball game right now. Ready with the first pitch. Here it comes. Lifted the other way out to left center. Under it is Rasmus now for route number two. Digging in to try it again. Eduardo Nunez. No hits in three tries so far. He struck out once. And he'll get back in safely. And another throw over. And he'll get dirty, but he's back in safely. Come on, guys. Let's go. He's set. Here it comes. And that's lifted in the air. God dang it. Rasmus has a read on it. No trouble with this one. And the inning is over. One left for the Yankees. Still no score. Great. Hall of Fame plus. Are you freaking kidding me? Really? Try and get something started in the home half of the seventh. Pops this one up. Just beyond the infield on the right side. Martinez backs not gonna help my freaking road to the show pitcher very much though stepping in Brian Dozier he's 0 for 2 with a strikeout in this one a swing and a miss just out in front of that fastball he's been doing a nice job out there on the mound but the deeper you get into the game the more the hitters have seen you this is the part of the lineup that he has to be really careful with off the plate and in. It's a ball and a strike. Chop foul over towards the coaching box. Trying to send him packing for the second time. A shot down the first baseline. But this is a foul ball as the count holds steady at one and two. Again, a one two. And oh, a big nice. the curveball, but he didn't get it, and he becomes the second casualty of the inning. Coming to the plate now, Buster Posey. It's been an 0 for 2 effort for him to this point. 
starts him out with a changeup for a strike. Well, Matt, we talk about first pitch strike, right? Look, it's not great what he's been doing, but he's over 60% of the time. First pitch is going to be a strike. No! Victor, you piece of crap. You didn't go for that, really? In there, base hit. Bottom of the seventh inning will go at least one plate appearance deeper after the two out hit. Well, he got jammed on that one right there. This is strong enough to muscle it in the right field for the base hit. It's going to be a line drive tomorrow. In the nice. And here's a ball hit in the air. And that will conclude matters here in the seventh. Ready for another shot now. Victor Martinez. Come on, Victor. Have the first crack at it Let's get here. double here. Victor Martinez. Oh, come on! What's with the freaking fly balls? And that's the first out of the inning. Now at the plate, Gene Segura. He flew out in his last at bat. And he gets ahead here with the fastball. Strike one. Set to deliver the 0 and 1. And he just misses with a curveball. No runs, eight hits. And one error on the Yankee line score so far. Outside with the fastball as the count moves to two and one now. I think he'll be frustrated with himself about that swing. He was in a good hitter's count and ended up chasing one out of the zone. Now the count's even again. Into the windup. Here comes the 2-2 pitch. In the dirt, but swung on and missed. And he makes the throw to first. Segura is retired. Two down now. So stepping in, Stephen Vogt. A couple of singles to his credit thus far. And he'll try to crowd him there to start the at bat. It's one and oh. The wind up and the one oh pitch. High in the air and drifting out to shallow center. Marisnik moves over, makes the catch, and that'll retire the side. One, two. Ready now, Colby Rasmus. He'll see what he can do leading off the home eight. Left fielder. And there's his strike right down the heart of the plate, 0 and 1. I think he's pitched better than anyone really expected in this one. He's done a real nice job, but someone's right. going to make him pay if he puts too many more pitches in that location. And this catches the zone as well. It's 0 and 2 now. A swing and a shot hit down the corner. And that ball will stay fair, and it's gone. A home run. Wow, talk about a guy getting hot, right? Well, that sucks. Out of the Yankee dugout now is Joe Girardi as he'll head toward the mound. And he's going to make a move as that's going to be all for his starter this afternoon. Here's Kelly Johnson as he loops under the ball and pops it up. Martinez is over and he's got it for the first out of the inning. Center fielder number six. Here's Jake Marisnik. He comes in All 0 for right 2 there. thus far. Hey. And that's on the outside corner for a strike. Slap hard the opposite way. And that will fall in front of Stanton. It's a base hit. Number nine batter comes through that time as it'll now be up to the top of the order with one away. Third baseman. Digging in the switch hitter, Jose Ramirez. One in, one out, and one on here in the inning. And a called strike down in the zone, nothing and one. That's taken, now it's 0-2. Two tough pitches. Looking at both of them, they're both the same pitch, it looks like, in the same location. He just wasn't ready for it. You got to be ready for anything now. In the dirt here. Stepping in, Marcus Semyon. Fourth trip to the plate for him, and he's at risk of ending that nice hitting streak that he's put together. Yeah, chances are it's on his mind, Matt, but you just have to let that get out of the way as best you can. You have to approach this at bat just like any other. Otherwise, you're just getting in your own way. Takes a look down at the knees for a strike. 
He's set. Here comes the one-one. Heading out towards shallow right. It'd be nice if I could get a freaking run here. And the inning is over. The A strike for Jerry Spamilia comes on from the pen, hoping to finish this one off here in the top of the ninth. Hit here, and he's the potential tying run. Swing and a liner. Oh, come on. But this is going to get foul. a slider that runs inside that time and that'll keep him from diving out over the plate. One and one, here it comes. And he gets a piece of this one to foul it toward the backstop. Here's the one and two. Mind to the right side. Mind. Coming up yes. Sanders, but he won't get there. It's a base hit. So the leadoff hitter reaches base as the potential tying run here in extra innings. Up next for the Yankees. Settling Center in now, Rajay Roger Davis. Davis. He'll Davis. be looking for something he could drive into the gap and drive home that tying run from first. And Ichiro's running. And a step off, but he's safe at first as he gets back in time. Quick check on that tying run at first, and the runner back safely. Another look to first. No! Mm, my God! Come on! First movement all the way, and apparently the pitcher knew it too. Caught him leaning. First delivery to him on the way. Way in front of a great slider that time. The 0 1. And here's a ball hit in the air. In there. Well, oh, that sucks. Ah. Uh. They've left a lot of men on base. They've had plenty of opportunities. And here's another one. After a base hit, they find themselves with another runner on. Let's see if they can bring somebody home this inning. Here's Ben Revere as he swings and grounds it toward the hole. And that's in for a base hit. He's two for four now. And that runner will go no further than second as there are two aboard now. Well, oh, that's a nice base hit right there. They got a little something working here, Matt. We got the tying run at second base and the go-ahead run at first base. How's it going to unfold? Giancarlo Stanton now. And he gets under this one as the ball is skied into... No! Dozier will have plenty of room as he makes the catch, and there's a big out number two. Now batting, second baseman. Come on. D. Gordon. As he'll look to bring home that tying run from second with a base hit into the outfield. Trying to hold the lead. Here's the delivery. And this one gets away. So now two men in Just need a hit. Big spot. Two out. Possible tying and go ahead runs on base. And this ball's in the air. Are you field. kidding me? And that's going to be your final out here. And the A's have taken the finale here. They win the series three games to one as the ball game is over. A single run good enough to do it today. one nothing. the final score. That is irritating. Castaneda wins his team leading 10th game of the year. Marco Estrada is settled with a loss after giving up only one earn. Jerry's Familia closes the door for the save. His 16th.